I'm Mark Frommeyer. I'm the founder and president of Arkimoto. I started Arkimoto three and a half years ago with the goal to build products that will help us catalyze a shift to a sustainable transportation system. If you look at the way that we get around today, it's in these enormous constructions of steel powered by a very inefficient source of, of energy, fossil fuels that are not replenishable in order to solve what are really very ordinary problems. Going to the grocery store for a gallon of milk, going to work, going to school, going to the movies. And to solve that very ordinary transportation problem of moving one person and a small amount of stuff, the dominant paradigm uses a 5,000 pound vehicle powered by gasoline. In the world of 1900, at the dawn of the internal combustion age, that made sense. You could tap some ground in Texas, oil geysers out, it's incredibly cheap. There was no awareness of the external effects of torching all of that energy. And in a world where there were no cars on the road, we didn't have things like gridlock and congestion and, and so on. So having all of that excess capability was a real advantage. It's not the world that we live in today. In the world we live in today, people are commuting by themselves in parking lots, essentially on the freeway. We import the majority of our transportation energy, in many cases from places in the world that don't like us. And the world is becoming more and more and more painfully aware of the cost to all of us of the continuance of that behavior pattern. The mission of Arkimoto is to develop products that more appropriately solve that simple transportation problem. When we were looking for the solution, the direction to move in, in terms of developing the Arkimoto vehicles, we looked at what was available on the road today. And there's a huge gulf in the marketplace. On, on the low end, you have vehicles like bicycles, scooters, motorcycles, two-wheelers that are incredibly efficient, some of the most efficient vehicles humanity has ever created, but lacking in terms of critical features like stability, enclosure, safety, and carrying capacity. And then you have full-size cars, SUVs, station wagons, and so on, but in that gap, there's nothing. In the gulf between the bicycle and the car, there's a catalog of, of, of nice tries. There, but nobody has found the real sweet spot in that gulf. So Arkimoto is aiming for that sweet spot. What, what can we do that blends the efficiency of a much lighter weight vehicle with the capability, security, and stability of a familiar four-wheeled automobile? All of our development process is centered around finding and honing in on that ideal target sustainable ride. What we've looked at is looking very closely at the way people use cars and coming up with a new vehicle platform that solves that same set of problems in a much more efficient way. At the baseline, we use a pure electric drivetrain. So it's about three times as efficient as, as your standard gas burning internal combustion engine. It can be powered by renewable sources, solar, wind, et cetera. But we didn't just say, let's just take an electric drivetrain and put it into an existing car. We actually built a new vehicle platform from the ground up designed around the common everyday driving usage pattern. The Arkimoto vehicles have three wheels instead of four, which means less rolling resistance. It has the, the passengers sit in line, which means a smaller aerodynamic footprint. And the vehicles are lighter by more than half than a conventional car which means practically both a lowered embodied energy, the amount of energy that it takes to build the vehicle in the first place, as well as significantly reduced operating energy, the amount of energy it takes to push you and the vehicle that you're in down the road. We're not looking at changing the behavior pattern of people in terms of how they get from A to B, but simply constructing a more appropriate solution for the problems that daily drivers have every single day. The typical pattern for people driving is one, sometimes two people, driving a relatively short distance with a relatively small amount of stuff. And by focusing our solution on specifically that problem, we've been able to come up with a product that's both very useful for solving 
people's daily transportation needs. Incredibly efficient relative to any car out on the road today. And practical, affordable, fun. So throughout the prototyping process of our first four prototypes, we looked at the basic product vision, the amount of footprint that it took up on the road, the concept behind the vehicle product line, and then ultimately honing in on a new vehicle platform, something that from a ride perspective carried the benefits of a full-size car, but was an order of magnitude more environmentally efficient than cars on the road today. That development through those first four generations was then coalesced into a single product prototype concept called the SRK. We unveiled that in April of 2011, and since then have been working on refining that product prototype into our actual first pilot vehicle. The, the pilots will be sold to key early adopter customers up and down the West Coast our main task now is to acquire the resources to complete the development of the vehicle and then ultimately bring that vehicle into market next year. Arkimoto is an opportunity to get involved. We're looking for early adopters. We're looking for help to move from our product prototype state to getting our actual pilot vehicles on the road in our key market areas. Uh, I'm looking for help for people to spread the word, talk about appropriate transportation, talk about sustainable mobility, talk about Arkimoto.